In ancient mythology, lightning was thought to be a weapon of the gods. Through time, people turned to superstition to control it. Church bells were rung to chase away evil spirits that caused the fire in the heavens. Lightning has been likened in, in, uh, centuries ago to an electric fire that used to pour out of the clouds and actually until Benjamin Franklin demonstrated that lightning was in fact the same thing or made of the same kinds of things that make up static charges that we pick up walking across a rug, people actually thought it was fire. Benjamin Franklin flew history's most famous kite into a Pennsylvania thunderstorm in 1752. He hoped to attract the mysterious force of lightning, and he did. Although lightning didn't strike the kite, minor charges in the clouds did travel down the damp kite string to a key, and sparks jumped to Franklin's knuckles, proving his theory that lightning is not fire, but electricity. A typical ground strike begins when negative charge from the cloud zigzags toward Earth, forming an electrical pathway between the cloud and the ground and inducing a positive charge along the ground. When the channel reaches positive ground, electrons rush out, creating the familiar flash of lightning and the shockwave of thunder. It happens too quickly for our eyes to see, but if you could slow things down, you would notice that as the electrons rush out, they leave positive charge behind that attracts more negative charge higher up the pathway. So the flash actually travels up, not down. <laughs> 